Hi Capricorn, it's L here to do your oracle reading for this week. Thank you for being here with me. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Capricorn. Thank you Lord God for blessing Capricorn with a clear, concise message from you. Who, who skips past that in the beginning? <laughs> I want to know. Let me know if you if you uh, you fast forward past the introduction. I don't know why that came to my mind. Um, some of you, there could be co some consistency or constant something constant going on in your life, um, whether it's good or bad. It is constant here. Um, let's see what's going on. If it says if you want to change anything, change starts with you. See what's going on for my Capricorns gifts. There, I love them. Somebody send me a gift. Um, so these could be actual physical gifts, spiritual gifts, but gifts being imparted to you, or maybe you're giving gifts to someone else here. Um, let's see. Gifts. Say for a gift. All right. A young male. Okay, so Capricorn, um, you could be this young male or you're dealing with someone who's younger than you. Uh, if they're not younger than you, they have this like youthful vibe about them. They could drive a nice, sporty, fast car. They could get a lot of attention because of the things that they have. Someone could be materialistic also here with gifts and young men showing up. Um, someone is just inexperienced. Um, they're just not... 100% serious about commitment and relationship. They're having fun. They're living life. Okay. Short term. Yeah. Maybe this relationship with this young man or um, someone who is kind of appears young, um, maybe in, in spirit. Um, it's short term. This relationship came into your life to show you what it is you don't want, you do want, what you should accept, what you should not accept here. Um, Something is definitely short term here. Um, it's an eye opener. Okay, so there's going to be a breakup or a breakdown. Also, if you are apart from someone, you could be coming back together with them. The breakup was short term. We've got blonde female. Someone who is um, not as knowledgeable, um, not as well versed, um, is still finding her way. Um, could be ignorant to certain situations or uh, viewpoints. Uh, true gem showing up here too. Um, there, the element of surprise here. Um, expect the unexpected from the least expected person. This could be a gift. Again, you got gifts. This could be an engagement. Um, do expect the unexpected here. A good, a good surprise. Let's see. Ice queen coming up. All right, so we got two women, one man on the board. Um, I don't know if somebody is pacifying the other with gifts. Somebody had to disconnect from the connection um, because somebody, the other person, the significant other could have found out or was on the verge of finding out about this extramarital relationship. Someone is showing up as the ice queen, having a lot of life experience, having gone through so many different things. Maybe in this relationship here, the ice queen is also searching for the truth. She expects nothing but it. She gives the truth. She also doesn't mince words. She means what she says. Yeah, somebody was cheating here. The thief coming out. All right, so trying to swindle. Look, um, so this is a situation where maybe somebody's married or couple. There's somebody outside of the connection. Um, they're giving gifts to, you know, showering them with affection, um, trying to get away with it. And it looks like they almost did or they did or there was suspicion of it. Um, somebody is cheating, has been cheating. Um, it's trying to swindle the other out of um, their good nature, their good energy. Something, the exchange is happening. Consolation, somebody feels like, yeah, you're not giving me enough. Maybe the outside person feels like, I need more. That's not enough. 
or maybe this guy or this girl, whomever is cheating, feels like I need more. I want more time with this person. Constancy coming out again. It came out in the shuffle for you. Um, it says if it's good, it'll rem remain good. If it's bad, it's going to remain bad. Nothing is changing unless you change. Um, things are going to be constant. There will be some communication coming into you. If you're waiting for a yes answer or approval, um, it is coming to you. Um, room. So there might be some um, unexpected meeting or something is unexpected while someone is running errands out about town. Somebody runs into the other. I don't know if the two women run into another, to each other or the man runs into the other woman. I don't know, but some doors are, are being opened here um, that were closed. Yeah, a young woman showing up again. We definitely have this young woman. There's the man, and then there's the other, the, the main chick, the um, wife or whatever. This young woman is not exactly serious about this connection. She's exercising a lot of joy and joyfulness, and she's having fun with her friends, and she's out and about. Um, a new start or maybe a new relationship or a new development, maybe even a pregnancy. Someone could be jealous. The other woman is jealous maybe because the... There's so many damn women here. Um, because someone is pregnant, someone is having a new start. Someone has a... Is, becoming the green eye monster. They want what they don't possess. They want what they don't have. They're looking in on someone else's life. What is this about? This is, I'm so tired of this. Every single week, we when we pull out these oracle cards, here come the shit. All right, what is this? What is this? Lord God, I um, Someone's saying, I purposely keep you confused. Yeah, there's like an air of confusion here. Maybe the young woman is confused about what, what her um, place is or where her state is in this relationship, what, what her status is. Maybe she thinks she's above the, the marital partner or the main chick. I don't know. And, and it says, understand something. You have complete control in this situation. So someone is making you feel confused, but you actually have control in this. Um, just take yourself out of the equation if you feel like you are something that's out of control or out of your control remove yourself that's what I'm saying as long as you let me stay I'll stay it's like um, I'm the devil spawn Jesus Christ um, it says we both are cheaters so why not get back together um, ghosted you but I'll be back so I don't know, there's an energy of maybe this man ghosting the younger woman or the other woman outside of the connection because the wife was due to find out or find out or she was due, maybe due to have the baby. Um, someone is saying, as long as you let me stay in your life, I'll stay. Um, they're letting you know that they don't have any good intentions. They're the devil spawn. Um, if the wife did find out about this person cheating. It's like we're both cheaters, so we might as well get back together. And if you are the one being ghosted, do know you're being ghosted because there is another person in this other person's energy. If you don't know, now you know. If they have been purposely keeping you confused, now you know. Uh, okay, two more cards. Right. Someone's saying, I'm not taking responsibility for you being hurt. Um, someone is just like, no. And uh, this fell onto the floor. You have too many kids for me. Sorry. I don't know how that fits in, but it's very self-explanatory. Um, someone feels like you have too many liabilities, too many responsibilities, and too many children. Uh, so, I don't know. They're saying sorry. Maybe they're going to ghost you. Maybe they're not going to stick around. Maybe they have no intentions for you. Let's leave you with a chakra oracle card see what chakra you should be focused on moving forward nope okay. all right all right you are so confused because you won't listen to your intuition third eye chakra and we have another card of uh confusion too where is it 
Um, someone's saying, I purposely keep you confused. Yeah. Um, somebody needs to listen to their intuition. Somebody keeps pushing that little voice away, pushing it down, because it's speaking to you the truth. And you, you might not want to hear the truth right now. All right, so let's leave you with a tarot card, one tarot card that will sum up the reading because we did not have weekly tarot card readings. We'll leave you with this one tarot card. Okay, there we are. Nine of Pentacles. Okay, so someone, um, you're single, you're abundant, you have all that you need, um, but you feel like you want family, value, structure, order a uh, legacy but there is um somebody who can't give that to you because that position is already filled in their life they also may feel as if you're very independent here ferociously independent to the point where someone is asking themselves well where do i fit in your life somebody also feels like you keep relationships at arm's length or outside of your heart space, outside of your home. You don't, there's no intimacy here. They don't know anything intimate about you. Yeah, there's an energy of you just need to go into self-development. You don't need to give your cup of emotion away to anybody right now. You need to listen to your intuition about maybe fixing some, some of your own problems within yourself. We all have them. Um... Because somebody is going in between you and another person. Okay? And they are actively lying to you. And they love the in-between. It's not taxing or burdensome or stressful or drama-filled to them at all. They love the in-between. Okay? They love the two options. Two or more. If this reading resonates for you, go over to the website. Book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. Pay for your question and receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. You can also donate to the channel if you're feeling moved to do so by buying me a coffee. Yep, the link below says buy me a coffee. And if you feel like you're in an energy where you just want to release negativity, negative emotions, negative thinking, overthinking, overeating, overindulgence, addiction, uh, anxiety, confusion, take part in the full moon release ritual happening July 23rd. The link is below for you to take part in that. Use that full moon energy to release, to relinquish, to have a new slate, a new start. Thank you, Capricorn. Many blessings to you. Take care.